Now I want to make some kind of closure on kernel map technique and I want to clone uh, uh, kernel map technique on one expression uh, and perform all steps at once. So we'll start with uh, simplifying with turning an expression that we want to simplify into truth table. And the expression will be the following. A negated, B negated, C plus A negated, B, C plus B, uh, say, C negated plus B negated, C negated. And first thing we'll do, we will uh, uh, turn it into the truth table and it's uh, uh, step number one. So it's step number one, and we turn it into a nice truth table. Oops. So we have three variables here, A, B and C. And here we go. The combinations will be 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 1. 0, 1, 0, 0, 1, 1, 1, 0, 0, and we can maybe reuse part of them, Ta -da. and 1, 1, 1. Now let's uh, create a uh, truth table. For all zeros, uh, this uh, term will be will be 0 because we have c is 0, this term is 0, c is 0, b is 0, this term is 0, but b negated, c negated, they will be 1s after negation, so the result will be 1. Then uh, I don't want to, to calculate them, to calculate all the terms, because uh, at this step you can just try to see uh, into, into each term and if it's 1, then you don't need to calculate all other terms. Then I hope you understand why. Then, uh, next case. Uh, A, B, C, C is 1, A, B is 0, then with this term will be 1. Yes, right. Then next one, 0, a0, zero, C0, zero, that means this is 0, this is 0, uh, then this term, B C negated, B is 1, C is 0, C negated is 1, then this term will be equal to 1. Then this one, mm, A is equal to 0, then mm. for this term, this uh, for this uh, case, this expression, will equal to 1, because a is 0, then a negated is 1, then again 1, ok. Then uh, for this expression, bc, bc are 0, so that means bc negated will be, will be 1, again 1, then 1, 1, uh, b0, that means Okay, this one will be 0, this one will be 0, C is 1, this one will be 0, C is 1, this one will be 0, the result will be 0. Then, uh, <laughs> then for last but one case, this is 0. This will be 0 because A is 1, you see. This will be this will equal one because c is zero. Then c negated is one. And the last one, all ones. Uh, no, it will be zero because in every term we have something negated. That ah no 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 wait wait see. that's not the right thing the right thing to think. Uh, but yeah, it is. It is in all terms something is negated, it means somewhere we will get zero. 
in all terms we will get zero eventually. So this is our truth table. And next step will be converting truth table into kernel map. Let's so it's step number three. Step number sorry to yellow. It is yellow. Some kind of orange. Uh, step number two. And I will do kernel map right here. So we have three variables. So it will be A here and B C here. And cases will be zero 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 one 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 as you remember one zero and uh, zero one four a. Let's map our truth table to kernel map. Uh, zero zero zero, it is one. Then zero one uh, zero sorry zero zero one zero zero one is one zero one one. This one is one. Uh, many ones zero one zero. This one is one. Uh, one zero zero. This one is one. Uh, one. O one. This one is zero. Uh, this then one o ones is one and oh now I see the mistake. Uh, in this one, I I said yes I said that uh, uh, all terms have something negated. That means in all terms we have zeros. It means this one will be zero. Sorry for that. Big zero. And that means that one 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 in this case here will also have zero. Then one one zero. One one zero is this one is one. So the, now we have a nice kernel map. Next uh, we are going to do grouping. Let's do grouping, and it's going to be easy. So step three. We, as we remember, our grouping rules. Uh, groups should be rectangular, made of one, two, four, etc. cells, which are two in the power, this, this number should be two in the power of something, then it should be, there should be groups as minimum as possible, and they should be as big as possible, and they could overlap each other, and they could be crossing boundaries, a la Pac-Man. So, first of all, uh, we need to make as, as less groups as possible, and we can overlap them. So the, the one group of four that you can see here is this one. Yeah. And another group of four that will be overlapping this one. That will be overlapping and crossing crossing the boundary and overlapping this one will be this group. Like this. That means we have uh, two groups here. Group number, uh, group number, light green and group number dark green. Yep. And yeah, that was super easy. We figured step three, forming group, and now we uh, get a simplified expression. Step four. Uh, so, and let's start with our first group. Our group number dark green. Here we have, uh, it's, we, already we can see that it's A what matters in this group. Because B, C changes. You, you see that B is 0 here and 1 here, and it changes. Uh, 
and C also changes. But uh, let's remind me how it works. I will just write down all the cases uh, that is covered by this group. So it's uh, th these four cells, cases for these four cells, 0, 0, 0. So I will write A, B, C, 0, 0, 0, then 0, 0, 1, 0, 0, 1. Then zero one one zero one one then zero one zero zero one zero and again we uh, what cares is only the groups uh, only the variables that uh, don't don't change that means in this case only a is the variable that is not changing so we don't care for b and we don't care for C. Uh, so the first term in our result will be A. And the next term for group for light green group will be so let's uh, write down cases A, B, C, 0, 0, 0. Then this one will be 1, 0, 0. This one zero one zero zero one zero and uh, sorry this one will be one one zero and what we see is that uh, it's C that is constant that means uh, C doesn't change that we that means that we don't care for A and B because they change. And uh, I found one mistake. Uh, C is zero, so that means in the result it will be C negated, because the C should be zero in order to this group of variables become, uh, these cases become ones. And the same for A, it should be negated, because it's A should equal to zero in order to the cases behind that group to be equal to 1. And this is our result, our resulting expression. Uh, and this is our initial expression. You can see, and you should try to optimize this expression by hand without kernel map technique to see uh, how, how it could be just to compare the kernel map technique with, with, that we just found and uh, simplifying expressions by hand. Yeah. So good luck. And I think that's it for Canon Map uh, for now. Let's move on.